Wow, cute, the unexpected. Hey guys, welcome to today's vlog. Today is 2.30 on Tuesday, May 8th. We just got a package. We're gonna open it. It's gonna be really exciting. Oh my God, it's my Givenchy box. So excited. It feels really light though, so I don't think there's that much in it. Whoa, ooh, what's that? What is this? Oh, that's pretty. The Culture Twist for Soft Matte Lips. Givenchy's newest couture creation invites you to expect the unexpected. A tantalizing texture that's revealed like a twist of fate. A velvet matte that never feels matte. What starts out as a classic Givenchy signature black leather and melt stud lipstick case opens to flaunt a never before seen pen like foam applicator that's designed to deliver just the right amount of long lasting, super vibrant, whipped, creamy liquid color. Its hyaluronic acid formula hydrates and smooths like a nourishing lip balm, while clay extracts create a brilliant sheath effect that wraps your pout in intense color without a hint of drying. Gatulin. I don't know how to say that. There you guys go. You can read the rest of it. Woo! Oh, oh my god. It's so cute. Oh, it's warm. Look at how cute that is. Velvet finish. Does this have a color? Oh yeah, it does. It's a nude. Woo! Oh my god. This is such pretty packaging. Oh my god. Wow. I am so impressed. There's their little logo. Oh, you can see all the stuff in my room. The name and everything right here. How do you open it? Oh, there it is. Oh my god. Why is there white stuff? Is that how it's supposed to be? Oh my. Oh my god. I just twisted it up and stuff came out. I don't know what to do with it. Do we put it on? Oh my. I think I squeezed out way too much color. Definitely not my best application. It feels really nice on the lips. Here's a close up. It looks really pretty. I kind of like it. This applicator is so nice. I've never had an applicator like this before. And this is like a liquid lipstick. Should have probably read the directions, but I didn't feels really nice. I think I put a little too much on. Hey guys, so I just came back from walking my dog. It is 3.02 now and I'm going to wash my makeup brushes. These are the two that I use the most often. I keep forgetting to wash them. Also, I think I'm going to take the lipstick off. My hair keeps sticking to it. It gets on my teeth. It feels really nice. It doesn't feel drying like normal matte lipsticks, but if you guys would like a whole main channel video about the lipstick, let me know by leaving a comment and giving this video a thumbs up. I'm going to just time lapse me doing it so if you guys want to know how I clean my makeup brushes that link will be in the description and also in a card because I already uploaded that video on the main channel if you're not subscribed to the main channel go do it it's in the description and also how I take my makeup off that's also on my main channel so I'll link that in the description as well and also in a card All right guys, so I took off the lipstick and I reapplied my grande lips because I didn't really wait the five minutes for it to settle in. If you haven't, I don't think the main channel video is gonna be up by the time this goes up, but it'll be on my main channel. Go watch it. I'm trying it out for 30 days and letting you know if it plumps my lips because if you haven't seen the first version, go watch that. The link will be in the card and also in the description. It didn't really work, so I asked you guys on live stream. And if you haven't seen that live stream, I will also link it in the card and in the description. If you guys wanted to see me try it for 30 days and a lot of you guys said yes, that is what I'm doing. Hey guys, so it's 6.30 now. I thought I would show you my outfit. I'm going to go out and walk my dog. Okay, so this is what I'm wearing. I have this cute crop top from Brandy Melville. I will link it in the description. I will link it in the description and I have these shorts from Toby. These shorts from Toby.com that I will link in the description as well as the shirt from Brandy. And I just thought it was super cute. I showed it in the last vlog. So you guys should probably see this in a haul on my main channel soon, but I always give you guys behind the scenes of stuff that happens on my main channel. You guys are always the first to see it. And if you're subscribed to my vlog channel, thank you so much for being here. It means the world to me. I love you so much.